today's plan first is to get the American flag up. And we planned on doing this a while ago. I've always wanted to do it, but I couldn't find a big enough flag uh, that was made in the US. So try number three with lack of enthusiasm on the other ones and uh, feeling like I'm half asleep still. <laughs> Sorry, Jess is dancing in the background over here trying to get me to get some energy going. So we got to come up with, I ordered some brackets for it, but I forgot to hit order on it. <laughs> and so um, they didn't get ordered until today. So now I'm kind of going, all right, well now I need to make something to make this work. So I think I've got to build a clamp to do it. I think the CNC plasma cutter is going to have to be used. And my new brake. Shuck Starnery. Right? My thought is, I'm going to build a little clamp, probably something like this. Put a bend in it somewhere down here so that when it comes down over and it screws down, it'll clamp against, basically it'll clamp against the structure and the flag will hold in right here. That's my thought. So we can screw it in like right there. Okay. Let's go see if we can do this with the, can with the CNC. So we're gonna go into some generic, I feel like I'm smacking this thing. Um, let's see, what do I want? Oh, where's, there it is, 48 or 49, probably 49. Okay. Well, now if I could duplicate that eight times, I'd be set. That's not so hard. It's getting that same angle <laughs> each time. Luckily, it doesn't have to be precise on this. I'm sure there's a way to set it. And then set it and forget it. But no. So let's let them dry off and paint them white so they'll look a little bit better up there. Clean them up. I just don't want a big old rusty thing hanging on my flag. And I don't want to mark up the flag. So we'll get it painted and then we'll get, them, we'll get that flag hung. Here's one very important thing to me. Made in the USA, I had to. I just had to. All right guys, so here's the deal. We got our flag up and to us, we are super patriotic. Um, we believe in this nation and what it's meant to be in our constitution. So in out of respect, and now that the American flag is up in here, we are going to go ahead and give the what, Mason? Um, what are we gonna do? We... Uh, did you do? Ah, uh, really? Dude, <laughs> the, the pledge of allegiance. The pledge of allegiance. Okay. All right. Who would like to lead us in it? Go ahead, Tegan. Repeat after me. I pledge, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands. One nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you guys. Now who wants to sing the national anthem? Just kidding. That's it. Okay, so today's plan is to finish cleaning up the frame. And so basically I'm just lightly sanding the whole thing down. It's already hours and hours into it. So, I just got dirty already. All right, so today's plan is to finish cleaning it up and hopefully get it primered. 
At the very least, I am going to get a test coat done on something that we can test some paint on. Oh yeah, this is fun. Okay. All right, let's get to it. <laughs> Now it's a difficult task. I have not been looking forward to this. Kind of a knock. I've been more spooked by it than anything. I think I'm going to pull the tires on this side and lift this thing up with the crane and set it down. Well, we were just spraying this and we discovered somebody stole a nut off of this a while back. So we're gonna have to find a new one of those or still went off the other truck. So, yep. And of course, as soon as we're getting ready to do this, it starts to rain. So we had to throw tarps over, it stopped raining, and now we can do it. Right now we're just flipping the Six watch back on its uh, on back on the bottom. My dad's in the 320, which we still have yet to name. So if I were you, leave some names in the comments, okay? For the 320 cat. I was gonna say, I can see why people just paint their frames black. It's not going to be fun to get all this color on here, but it'll be worth it. Okay, so for tonight, we brushed it off, we cleaned it off, and we got the new primer on it. One step closer, guys, and I'm exhausted. Guys, you're exhausted? Yeah. I'd say that yawn is an exhaust. Tegan, you I'm exhausted? Exhaust. Yeah. yeah. Should we go to bed? Go in, relax. I'm gonna go to bed and read. Oh, well, you'll probably fall asleep while you're reading. Maybe, maybe not. Mason, what are you gonna do? I'm gonna fall asleep. You're not gonna go to Disneyland? Okay, you got a dirty face. I think you need a shower. I definitely do. <laughs> Look at this, I'm, I'm just coated like everywhere, especially my right arm. So, all right, everyone. We will see you tomorrow, and hopefully we will be test running our new color on this. We gotta do it. Well, unfortunately, I didn't get this on camera, but so I was just doing a little quick sand clean up on top of this on the primer. Slid my hand down where the chain had got. Little piece of little burr of metal. Okay. Right there. Went sliding down like this. Slid, cut that finger. Oh, yeah. Love the, the electrical tape. Cut that one. Punctured that one. Sliced. Sliced right through right there on that one. I'll go in and clean it up in a minute. But yeah, it sucks, it hurts. So hopefully this color takes good. This is what I'm planning on painting the frame. I'm gonna see for the first time. I've seen a little, you know, spot on top. Come here, Mason, come in closer. Show them what the paint is. Get in close. Ooh. Oh. Oh my gosh. It's wow. Frame of that. That and it's going to darken up a little bit because it's, um, you, you, you were going to touch it, weren't you? No, I wanted to, mm -hmm. yeah, can I ping up on No, it's, <laughs> no, you don't want that on your, <laughs> on your hand. Shiny, light and dark blue. It's so cool. I really hope this works. 
because if it does, it'll be so cool. Yeah, this isn't even as good a quality as we want. It's just a test run. We're gonna have to. Oh yeah, there's a lot of cleanup we gotta do before we actually paint. Yeah, I think we just gotta mix it up, like heat it up to get the bubbles out. Oh, it looks out. good in the camera though. It's a lot darker in person. Oh my yeah. The camera picks it up really well. Okay, let's let this air out and we'll come back and check it. Okay, just checking this out. Only this top, this spot over here, Jen. Oh. Just a test. I still got things to do, like I gotta pull or push these things out here. So, and then we're gonna have to find a nut for that suspension or rip it off the other truck. So, I still can't believe I found that missing. Um, okay, let me know what you think of the blue. I like it. I really, really like it. So we're going with it anyhow. But I want to know, did we make the right decision? I guess we'll know that when we get everything painted. Right, babe? <laughs>